Welcome! The following video will demonstrate how to add a new smart Z-Wave device to a 2GIG Edge security system. To add a smart device to an Edge system, begin by tapping the Settings icon. Next, you'll want to enter your installer code. The Settings menu will display, and you'll want to scroll to the bottom of the screen. Tap Installer Toolbox. Then tap Z-Wave Settings. The Z-Wave Settings menu will display on screen. Select Add Device. And then tap the Add Device button located in the bottom right corner of the screen. Next, you'll see a pop-up message on screen which reads, Initializing, please wait. Once the message changes to read, Listening, follow the smart device's manufacturing instructions for putting it into Add Remove mode. The panel will then locate and connect with the device. If you're adding a Z-Wave device with S2 Security, the panel will prompt you to use the on-screen keypad to type in the device's DSK or PIN code. Refer to your smart device's user guide for information on where to find this code. Once you're done adding the code, tap the Enter button. Note. This screen will only appear if you're adding a Z-Wave device with S2 Security. Next, your panel will display a series of pop-up messages while it adds the device. Once the device is added, you'll see a success message. Tap the Done button to close the success message. You'll then see a few more pop-up messages appear on screen as the panel finalizes the process. Next, you'll see the device details on screen. At this point, you'll want to rename the device. To rename the device, you'll need to tap the Edit icon next to the device details. You can then use the on-screen keypad to type the new name for this device. Once you're done typing the new name, tap the Save button located in the bottom right corner of the screen. Lastly, you'll want to tap the Done button to finish programming the Z-Wave device. Here's a troubleshooting tip. If you're not able to add the new Z-Wave device to the Edge system, there may be old programming still on the device as a result of factory testing. In this case, you'll want to remove the device first and then re-attempt to add the device. To remove the Z-Wave device settings, First tap Remove Device. Then tap the Remove Device button located in the bottom right corner of the screen. You'll then want to wait for the initializing pop-up message to go away. Once you see the listening pop-up message, follow your device's manufacturing procedure for putting it into Add Remove mode. When the device is successfully removed, you'll see a success message on screen. Tap the Done button to close the message. Then tap the Done button in the lower right corner of the screen to return to the Z-Wave Settings screen. You can then tap Add Device and repeat the steps we discussed earlier in this training. Add the rest of your Z-Wave devices using the steps we just discussed. Once you're done adding and installing all smart devices, you'll want to run a network rediscovery. To run a network rediscovery, tap Rediscover Network, and then tap the Start button. Once the rediscovery process is complete, you're all set. Repeatedly tap the Back button until the home screen displays. Congratulations! The new smart device has now been added to the 2GIG Edge system.